The city of Durham and Duke University have joined forces to address the long-term effects of gun violence. Together, they're funding a pilot program that will focus on people who've survived gun violence. WR's Monica Casey reports the goal is to facilitate the healing that will go beyond finding justice for the crime. The founders of the Prescriptions for Repair program are hoping to help gun violence survivors heal and use their input to improve the community as a whole. The public-private partnership includes $72,000 from the city of Durham and $75,000 from Duke University. City Councilor Leonardo Williams tells me the money will fund research focused on finding ways to address violence in the Bull City. This is a program that I think is going to be very beneficial to ask the, to answering the question why you know why are we experiencing so many you know uh you know, shootings and deaths that are so consistent of the same demographics. Dr. Henry Rice at Duke and Marsha Owen from Durham's Community Safety and Wellness Task Force have worked on the project for a year. Rice tells me gun violence survivors are falling through the cracks. Energies are traditionally focused on gun violence perpetrators, and we tend to ignore people who are most affected by that and the people who are shot. And this is designed to do an intensive listening-based structure where we listen to and helping survivors through their experiences. Owen explains as part of the listening session, survivors will have an opportunity to share their stories and their ongoing needs. So it's not about asking someone for the answer and then walking away. It's asking someone for the answer and then responding to that answer and building a community of, of belonging and compassion and healing. This pilot program will run for a year, but the founders are hoping the city will create an Office of Survivor Care to house the program for years to come. Monica Casey, WRL News in Durham.